Hi, this is Matt Sweeting, this is Bob Sweeting, and this is Monterey Race Week 2004. So, welcome to the McLaren 12C Spider. It's the first time we've shown this car to anybody in the whole world. Um, a year on from the launch of the 12C Coupe, it's the second model in the 12C family. Um, the, the Coupe was designed from the start to have a convertible version, so there's no additional body strengthening required for the Spider. No. That was going to be the question was, of course, you, you retract the roof so there's no needed body strengthening. Because we have a carbon fiber monocell that's so stiff, we don't need any extra strength. And the payoff for that is a minimal weight increase of Spider over Coupe, which is only 40 kilograms. And that's only the mechanics of the retractable roof? Yes, sir. Um, uniquely for a car in this class, you can lower or raise the roof up to 19 miles an hour, uh, which takes just 17 seconds. Um, the roof is made of a, of a sheet molded composite, so again, minimal weight addition. The driving experience for the Spider is no different to that of the Coupe. Um, in addition, though, we have a, a glass rear window um, between the buttresses, which is electrically operated. You can have it up as a, as a windbreak with the roof down, or with the roof up, you can put it down to get more ventilation through the cabin, and even better to hear the engine. And the engine is a 3.8 litre twin turbo V8 with 616 horsepower which is enough to get you to 60 miles an hour in 3.1 seconds. Uh, and if you're interested, you can drive it with the roof down up to 196 miles an hour. Uh, and prices, uh, prices start from $276,000. And I've said that many times in the last three days, and it seems to be very surprised it's not more. So perhaps we should be charging more. Well, it's designed uh, dynamically so that the wind goes right over while you're driving at speed. Yeah, I mean, we're McLaren. Our other business is Formula One cars. Obviously, aerodynamics is very important in Formula One. I have to say, we know what we're doing. Um, and at that speed, 196 miles an hour, you might feel a slight ruffle on your head, not that I have any, um, but it will be minimal. It's been interesting the last few days. We've met a few customers who have bought coupes. Uh, and they're already ordering a Spider, which is very positive for us because it shows that they're obviously very happy with their McLaren ownership experience. Visions for the future or something else you want to work you're working well, on? Well, if you read, if you believe the rumours, apparently we're working on a hypercar, apparently we're working on a successor for McLaren F1, and apparently you might see something quite soon on this, but I, I could possibly copy it. Ended up.